Today I'm going to show you how to make a Romero Brito style portrait. I know a couple things about Romero Brito. You guys always want to know, is he still alive? He is still alive. He's an artist from Brazil. He paints and sculpts and he's known for pop art, cubism, and graffiti in his work. Um, and he uses bright colors and patterns to express messages of hope, dreams, and happiness. And right now he lives in Florida. He's lived there since 1989 where he likes to do good things and sell his art to help kids. So let's get started. I've already drawn um, with pencil on here and I drew the face. I didn't quite finish it. I just whispered with my pencil. Remember, draw light until you get it right to give myself some lines to start with. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to grab a marker and if you don't have one of these Sharpies, you can use one of the dry erase markers. if you. Um, can't get a hold of a sharpie and I'm going to go over those lines now one of these markers is old and kind of smushed and the other is more pointed so I'll use the old smushed one on some lines and the new line or the new marker on some other lines Now, as you can see, this is not a self-portrait. This is a picture of someone else. And I'm going to make it abstract. Abstract, if you don't remember, means it doesn't look real. So it's going to be a little bit different. It's kind of fun to do abstract art because if it's not perfect, that's okay. You didn't mean for it to be perfect. And then get the top of the shirt, the collar. And now it's time to have some fun with patterns. So I'm going to divide up my background into some different areas using rays. And I'm going to divide up the clothing into some different areas just for fun. Maybe add some buttons. Right. And then another thing I'm going to do is get a white crayon and in some areas I'm going to add some details with the white crayon um, to start what's called a wax resist. So you can't see, whoops, I broke it, that's all right. You can't see the white crayon right now, um, but when I paint it, you will be able to see that. So some of these get crayons, some will get the marker again. And I'm going to speed this up so that you don't have to watch me do all of this, and then we'll stop it again.